nitrate is reduced almost quantitatively to nitrite in the presence of cadmium. This method uses commercially available cadmium granules treated with copper sulfate and packed in a glass column. The nitrite produced thus is determined by diazotizing with sulfonyl amide and coupling with one napphil ethylene diamine dihydrochloride to form a highly colored azo dye that is measured colorimetrically. The applicable range of this method is 0.01 to 1.0 milligrams nitrate N per liter. Wash 25 grams of cadmium granules with hydrochloric acid and rinse with water. Swirl cadmium with copper sulfate solution for 5 minutes or until a brown colloidal precipitate begins to develop. Gently flush with water to remove all precipitated copper. Insert a glass wool plug into the bottom of the reduction column and fill with water. Add sufficient copper cadmium granules to produce a column 18.5 centimeters long. Maintain water level above copper cadmium granules to prevent entrapment of air. Wash column with 200 milliliters of dilute ammonium chloride EDTA solution. Activate column with the highest standard. to 25 milliliters of sample or a portion diluted to 25 milliliters. Add 75 milliliters ammonium chloride EDTA solution and mix. Pour mixed sample into column and collect at a rate of 7 to 10 milliliters per minute. Discard the first 25 milliliters. Collect the rest in original sample flask as soon as possible and not more than 15 minutes after reduction, add 2 milliliters of color reagent to 50 milliliters of sample and mix. Between 10 minutes and 2 hours afterward, measure absorbance at 543 nanometers against a distilled water reagent blank.